yourself in the house that, unannounced? Yes, yes. Were you doing that? I, if I did, I would have always, I would rang the doorbell or knocked first. And if he did not answer. You just let yourself in? Well, I was worried about his health. He was always complaining that he had these health concerns. So I didn't know if I'd find a dead body in there or not. So for his health and safety. <laughs> I can assure you, safety. I'm very healthy. What did she say when you saw her? Well, I was startled. I was like, whoa, you know, what, what's going on? And she just said, oh, I just stopped by. You know, I you think check she on was, your health and safety? And well, well I don't think it was the health and safety, uh, but I, I don't know the reason. Is that I think, true? I think it was she probably said, to collect rent I, or no, to try I, to collect rent. No, I believe okay, that again, she stopped Ms. by. Okay, again, Ms. Benson, there are ways landlords go about collecting <laughs> rent. There are a lot of things you can do before you decide to use your key open up the door and just walk in unannounced because that's a serious invasion of privacy. What if he has a weapon? He's allowed to have a weapon in his home and, and he hears a noise, doesn't know who's inside, and in his defense, he just shoots. It could happen. It's happened. There are cases where that has happened.